front, Jen, the city is still doing its own investigation to try to determine exactly what went wrong. But today, officials said that it was a lack of clear communication about whose responsibility it was to move those Pfizer doses from the freezer to the refrigerator. As a result, those doses ended up in the freezer for too long, and that may have impacted the efficacy of the vaccine, though officials said that there's not a lot of information yet on how much of an impact that would have had. New Haven officials consulted with the Department of Public Health and Pfizer and say there's no evidence that it would be dangerous for anyone who received one of the vaccines. In total, officials say this impacted 625 people who are recommended to be revaccinated as soon as possible. The city says of those 625 people, it has been able to reach 61% of them. DPH did its own investigation of vaccine handling and storage here in New Haven, and officials say there were no findings of concern. But again, the city is still waiting for its own investigation to be complete before determining who will be held accountable and what will be done to make sure that this doesn't happen again. It is clear that there was a lapse in communication, which meant that the vaccines were not transferred properly in the right time. But at this moment, we don't want to get into a lot of details on employee issues before we make sure that that process takes place. Now, this incident impacts people who were vaccinated at the clinic here at the health department on Meadow Street in New Haven from December 23rd to February 7th. If that is you, the city wants everyone to know that you should be getting revaccinated. Live in New Haven, Gabby Molina, Fox 61 News.